Hi everyone, welcome to virtualbrigade.com. In this particular video, I'll show you how to configure the NSX Edge cluster. So in my previous videos, I have shown you how to deploy the NSX Edges and how do you add the NSX Edges from the command line and how do you uh, configure the fabric node and then we have discussed about how to configure the fabric node as the transport node. So let's go ahead and configure the NSX Edge cluster. So in order to configure the NSX Edge cluster, you need to log into the NSX Manager as an admin. And from the NSX Manager homepage, you can expand Fabric and then click on Nodes. And then you can click on Edges to see the number of edges configured in this particular environment. We, as I said, we have deployed the Edge 01A and 02A. So the NSX edges are required in order to configure the Tire Zero logical router. And then uh, if you want to enable the uh, services like NATing and the firewall services on Tire One logical router, you need to have the NSX edges deployed. And the NSX edge clusters are needed to provide the high availability for your Tire Zero logical routers. So uh, uh, let's go ahead and uh, click on Edge Clusters to create a Edge Cluster. Uh, from the Edge Clusters tab, you can click on Add. And uh, on the Add Edge Clusters page, you can uh, type the Edge Cluster name. So I'm going to call it as NSX uh, Edge Cluster. And then you can enter the description. This is for uh, Edge 01A and Edge 02A nodes that I have deployed. And uh, you can uh, uh, use the existing uh, Edge cluster profile. So there was a Edge cluster profile already available on the NSX manager, which is the default Edge cluster profile that I am using. If you want to add, you can click on the edit button. And then, uh, uh, as we know, the NSX edges can be deployed in the bare metal machine. So if you want to add the NSX edge nodes uh, from the bare metal, you can use the physical. Since I have deployed it as a virtual machine, I'm going to select virtual machine. And then you can select all the NSX edge nodes. So the edge cluster can be configured to a maximum of eight NSX edge nodes. So we have two already deployed. I'm going to add these two edge nodes in the edge cluster and then click on OK and then click on save. So this will uh, create the NSX edge clusters with two NSX uh, transport nodes. So in order to configure the edge cluster, we basically need to have the NSX edge nodes deployed and added to the NSX manager and then uh, uh, converted as the transport node and then you can come to the uh, edge clusters tab and then uh, you can click on add to create the NSX edge cluster. So uh, in order to configure uh, the tire zero high availability for your uh, tire zero logical routers, we need to have the NSX edge uh, cluster. 